Oh man, this is Gyro here in Australia and I got an exciting, exciting new piece of tech to review and it's that thing above. You can focus on that. This thing is called the Trigger Trap mobile dongle. So this thing is going to get hooked on to my iPhone so we can then do a nice little time lapse or better yet just a remote trigger from that from my phone yeah basically it, it'll explain itself when you when you see it in action but as of right now behind me there's the Eddie had stadium am I even pronouncing that correctly yeah, you are. yeah and it looks like it's on fire right now so yeah we're gonna do some a little bit of a test of this thingy this thingamabob now I'm really excited about this shit to be quite honest this is fucking phenomenal and right now, I'm doing this lighting thing with me light. Because we don't have a, a stand, we just have a monopod. It's alright. And apparently, there's a fucking party over there. <laughs> you can't really hear it, but it's a party and it's raging. I can see the lights. But that's about it. Now, we're going to do the actual test. Sweet. So now we got this thing strapped on. Pardon me. I'm not going to show you guys my code. It's. So now we got this thing hooked up here nicely. We're gonna launch the app, Trigger Trap app. And from here, I'm gonna go back to the main menu and I'm gonna go to simple cable release. If I, if I can get to it. <laughs> oh. There it is. There you go. So now if I hit this button here, it's gonna... Why is it not doing anything? So after a technical difficulty, I figured it out now. Again, everything has to be on manual in your camera, means the focus, means the little drive thingy, everything's gotta be on manual for this to work. So now when I hit this button, it does that. It takes a picture. Sweet. Now we're gonna get our hands dirty and actually do some testing. Bye-bye. Alright, sweet. So now we're doing the conclusion to the trigger trap dongle. And to be quite honest, I'd highly recommend this piece of gear to everyone just simply because it's so cheap and compares to everything else. It's yeah, you can't you, you can't really knock it. Um, needless to say, yeah, I already did the unboxing. This is what you get. Comes on this thing, it's not bad, I love it. Other than that, highly recommend it, and I can't wait to do my next video, um, giving you the pros and cons of the two, whether to do a time lapse using this, or for us Nikon shooters, doing a time lapse with the built-in time lapse, you know, feature. Which, to uh, I'll save the the argument for for the next video. But needless to say, thanks all you guys for checking us out. Well, not us checking me out on my YouTube channel and I greatly appreciate it if you guys give me some feedback or better yet just like and subscribe and yeah I can't wait for the next one peace